What's going on everybody? I'm bringing you some Madden salary cap gameplay. We're gonna need at least, I, I don't know, what, what do you think guys? Can we get 200 likes on this video? If we don't got 200 likes on this video, you guys are not showing me enough love. This is I'm Wild. This guy was in the semifinals against Problem Right last year in the Madden Championship. If you guys don't know about this guy, earlier in the year he beat the blood out of me. That video is available right here for your viewing pleasure. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna put it in the top right, uh, top right corner for you guys uh, with one of these things from uh, YouTube, the cards or whatever, so you guys can just click it and watch it. He beat the living and, yo, bro, listen, the dude treated me like a battered housewife right quick. And listen, that's not no laughing matter. I'm just letting you know, Greg Hardy was at my crib, took care of me right after I lost to him. So we're going to go ahead and jump into the gameplay. He came out with a wild offense, and uh, pretty much a lot of the top-level Madden players are running it. It's the bunch. And when you're playing bunch, you have to really apply yourself. If you're going to blitz, blunt, uh, I'm about to say blunt. Listen, bro, do not smoke weed unless you're of age, and even if you're of age, Make sure you know what's what you get yourself into. I don't know why I'm saying blunts. Don't worry about it. Um, but let's get back to the point here. This guy, I don't know why he tried to run that screen. I actually was supposed to pick that, but it's very, very hard to pick the uh, screens now that they've tuned the game. With the tuning that they've done, they've made it almost impossible to really click onto a defender that's by the screen and pick it. So it is what it is. Right there, we can see Brandon Cooks came to play. Dude is holding on to the ball. So right now, I'm like, all right, we good. We good money. Oh, okay. Yo, Brandon Cooks, though, what's good? Oh, he about to pick us up. All right, he goes for the swat right there. You guys already know, Brandon Cooks is the GOAT. And uh, for guys that are wondering, if you watched my previous video, Julio Jones is still in the game because he didn't actually sell. And when you lock in a lineup, they actually stay there. So that's the only reason that he's there. He did actually sell. Julio Jones is no longer a part of my team. And all my newer gameplay that I'm going to have for salary cap is going to feature Randy Moss, unless I have to raid sell his ass too. He's currently still on the team. If you guys have questions, a lot of guys are asking in the stream, um, you know, did I raid sell him after my last stream? If you guys have been watching my uh, my recap streams, they're available on Twitch at G Myers World. You guys can go ahead and enjoy that as well. But like I said, getting back to I'm Wild, he's up seven zip. He's punching my guys in the face. This guy's trying to come out, I rock, yo, outright and brutalize me, bro. The dude has no respect. Oh my, the dude's punching me in my jugular. Yo, the ref got to call that. Dog. I'm sorry about that. Oh, pick that. Let's pick that ball. Let's go. We about to do this, boy. Like I said, man, I'm just trying to figure out, like, oh, Derrick Henry too strong for that. You ain't doing no, bro, those tic tac files, bro. I mean, uh, tackles. You ain't doing that. Oh, why did I run so much? Oh, punched him in the face and then fumbled. Yo, this dude, Derrick Henry, bro. What the hell is wrong with that guy? Why is he fumbling like that for no damn? This guy's a bum burger. Yo, this mother. All right, let's go. We got to just get focused. But like I said, with the bunch formation, you pretty much got to take away a specific read that your opponent has been running and, and going to, you know, the entire time. That's the number one thing. Like, you know, when you motion them, he'll be open and stuff like that. If that's what you want to take away, if you take that away with the computer, you got to be ready for everything else with the user. Okay, if that was Madden 16, that would have been a touchdown. So, shout out to Rex Dixon and them boys at EA Sports for making the SWAT. You know, 94% of the time it'll work, I'll say. Um, so, look. Now he's going for it on fourth down. He's trying to disrespect me. Dude's trying to disrespect me, so we got to pick him off. Because the dude trying to disrespect me, dude's got to know. Come at me sideways, bruh. So, look at this dude, Julio Jones. Another pick, though? This dude, Julio Jones. Yo, bruh, he was already sold, though. That's the crazy part, but he's locked in the lineup. I hate that guy so much. In the game, though, not in real life. I love me some Julio Jones, but I don't know what they did to him. And that's the upgraded version. Again, the milestone version. I'm going to actually show you at the end of this video that he was sold. The dude is a bum bruh. Yo, I hate him. Actually, no. Is it at the end of this video? I don't know if I'm showing it to you at the end of this video. I think he was already sold, though. I don't, bro, I have no idea. All I know is that this guy is a piece of crap, dog. I don't know what the F he was thinking. I have no idea what he was doing. What is who? He about to catch that? Oh, he caught that one. All right, cool. Bro, it don't matter. Yo, I already, yo, he should have been gone by now, but was he gone? Or maybe it expired. Yeah, it, I, th I think the uh, auction expired during, oh my goodness. Anybody, bro, anybody, just pick the damn ball up. Bro, like Simba in the Lion King. Anybody, like, bro, pick the ball up so we can run it for six. Oh, he's still just doing whatever. So, like, I, who is this guy? This guy just punched people in the face all the damn time. Like, that's his automatic reaction? Just punch somebody in the goddamn face? Come on, man. Oh, right there, we had to hit him with the WWE move right quick. Uh, here, we got to just run the ball. Oh, okay, another. Oh, the center. Bro, the center guy. Oh, he got the juice now. Run it for six. That, this dude, Derrick Henry, has two fumbles. At least the second one was, uh, you know, we got it. We got it back. This dude just doesn't care about anything, bro. He just wants to fumble the damn ball every time. We got to go for it on fourth down. Like I said, this dude is a competitive player, so we can't take field goals right now. We can't tie the game up. We got to go for it. If he stops us, he stops us. He's still in a very bad situation by his own end zone. You see what I'm saying? You see how he has this guy in the flat, always ready? These are the reads that I'm talking about with Bunch. Bunch is a very, very... But Bunch has always been very, very special. So what I had to do was I had to switch up the D. 
You see what I'm saying? Start to mix, you know, mix the coverages around. Right there, I get dotted. I'm a bum. So that's the only guy I knew he was going to go to. Okay, right there, we just sent a heater. We just had to send a heater. Like, we weren't trying to do anything else. We weren't trying to disguise it. We just sent a heater. Now, it don't really matter. So um, we got the ball back now. We're up four. What I'm saying to myself is, look, if we get three, he's not going to go for two. I, I, at least I don't think so. The dude is not Jack Del Rio. I don't think he's going for two to win the game. So I'm like, look, let's stay in field goal range. That's the primary thing right here. Let's stay in field goal range and see if we could at least get a field goal. So that was my mindset. That's why you see me running the ball. I could have passed it and changed it up, play action, whatever like that. But I, I wasn't in that mindset to do it based on the defense he was running. You know what I'm saying? Like he looked like he wanted to stop the run, but his guys were like not playing the run the proper way. Right here, we can go ahead and swap that. Get that out of here real quick. Um, he's going to make some more attempts to do what's right. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, bro. Come here. Too long. You see what I'm saying? You put your, you got to put your zones in proper positions to make plays, and then you give them a second to make a read. That's all. You see right there, I should have somebody in the hard flat. But I wasn't really worried about it because he has no timeouts, so I didn't leave anybody for the hard flat. But again, you got to take away that main read. That flat is dangerous, but then you also got to worry about, you know, the little inverted uh, fade route. You see like that, like when it's open? That's what you really want to take away with it because usually you could have something with the running back. You see like how the guy was playing the running back? You can set it to have somebody play the running back. It's just a higher route that's out. You know what I'm saying? Like right there, he's going to try to dot me right there. But we over there. You keep a guy around that vicinity, that takes away the higher thing, and then you got to just play the pick. That's what you got to do out here, bro. That's what we need to do. And um, right here, bro, dot him. Let's go. Run for six. What are you do? Now you're going to trip? Oh, okay, bro. Come on, man. You can't trip. Bro, trip. Bro, look at this dude, Julio Jones. That's the last pass for Julio Jones. That man is gone. I think the, my auction had expired. So I think after this one, it's when, it, you know, we got the whole thing. These are our packs, whatever like that. He was our sixth win for salary cap. So now for any future gameplay, Randy Moss will be a part of the team. I'm going to let you go ahead and see what I got out of the packs. Let me know what you think about it. Did I get pack luck? Didn't I get it? I don't know what I'm getting. Leave a like. Let's hit 200 likes. I'm going to see you boys later, man. One love.